this is going to be a comparison between the Berna Kinetic for the for the Berna CL and the Sentinel from Less Lethal Ballistics. The uh, Berna Kinetic is two grams and the Sentinel is five grams. We're going to do a damage test on wallboard. Okay, so I'm about to perform a damage test to see what happens to a two foot by two foot by half inch piece of wallboard. I've got the Berna CL uh, and I'm going to fire four rounds of the Sentinel into the wallboard, then let the, war the launcher warm back up and then fire four of the Berna Kinetic rounds. Okay, I just put a temperature gun on on the CL, it's 68.2, on the screw near the barrel, closest to the barrel. Um, okay, I'm grabbing a CO2. Inserting it. Okay, I'm gonna fire the pierce, the first one. Now I'm gonna insert the magazine with four rounds in it. The room is 72 degrees, and this is approximately 20 feet. Thinking five. Sorry. Okay. So I'm going to pause, let the launcher warm up, and then fire for the burner kinetics. Okay, so it's been approximately 10 minutes, and I just put the temperature gun on the CL and in the same spot as before, and it's 68.1 degrees. I'm going to add a CO2 to it, insert the CO2, okay, I've inserted the CO2, I have the four burner kinetics loaded in, fire the first one. Okay, my back's against the wall, 20 feet. Discharge. Let's go see what we got. Okay, we have three three of the Berna CL the Berna kinetics have state embedded themselves into the wallboard. 
one has passed through. So one of the sentinels passed through, one of the Berna kinetics passed through, one of the sentinels embedded, but three of the Berna kinetics embedded. And the other two sentinels uh, were rejected. So in this test, I have to give the slight edge to the Berna kinetics, but it is just a slight edge. Um, this was at a distance of 20 feet. Since we, the Sentinel is heavier, what's going to happen is at a larger distance, the Sentinel will retain its ability to uh, impact with energy better than the Berna Kinetic, which is lighter. And as, it, as the distance to target increases, the velocity is going to drop more, the joules will drop more, and it's going to have less of an impact. So I would say at 25 feet, 30 feet, the Sentinel is going to be the winner. Also, too, you have to consider that uh, from Berna CL to Berna CL, they are going to have more or less of an ability to push a 5-gram weight. 5-gram weight is the weight of two pennies. Um, they Some of the launchers will have a, even more of a hard time pushing a five gram weight than, uh, than my launcher did. Some are gonna have an easier time. The easier time the launchers have, the better performance you're gonna get out of the Sentinel. Another variable is gonna be your CO2 cartridge. Different brands of CO2 cartridges are going to be under greater pressure uh, than others. So um, there's going to be variability in the, in the CO2 cartridges. Uh, that's going to affect the performance of the Sentinel because everything's right on the borderline here. Um, I'm hoping that uh, Berna will um, uh, improve their power of this launcher or that people will come up with a... Um, a mod to it that will increase the number of joules. Uh, five more joules and the Sentinel will outperform the Berna Kinetic easily at shorter distances. Uh, um, if this was a 20 joule launcher, the, um, the Sentinel would be able to be, uh, instead of a nine and a half joule, at, at muzzle velocity, uh, it, it would be, you know, it's going to be right up there, uh, probably 15 or even 20 joules. So um, uh, that's it. The only thing I can do at this point in time is, um, is say that the Sentinels are bore matched to the CL. I'm not going to be able to do anything better with the bore matching, and um, the um, material is aluminum, so it is what it is. At the perfect diameter, they they weigh five grams. So um, if the CL does not uh, improve its ability to uh, push a five gram weight, the weight of two of our zinc and copper pennies, if it can't push that, then uh, it can't push that. Um, um, I am investigating uh, lighter rounds, uh, maybe uh, a 3 gram or 2.9 gram, nylon only, uh, will outperform the Berna Kinetics. But for now, what I've done is lower the price of the Sentinel to $39.95 per hundred. So um, at that price, it is about 20% cheaper than the Berna Kinetics. And um, I, I stand behind the Sentinels. I think it's good ammo. I just think that the Berna CL is just uh, meager as far as its ability to push weights. And that's about it. Thank you. Dare I say it, would the Sentinel do better in a high-powered slingshot? Maybe.